Welcome to Manu TD News, your source for the latest news, analysis, and highlights about Manchester United. Join us to stay up to date on everything happening at Old Trafford. In a statement released on Friday, 17, Sheikh Jassim bin Hamad Al Thani, the president of Qatar Islamic Bank, confirmed that he has submitted an offer to buy the Manchester United Football Club. Al Thani's assets, estimated to be over £40 billion, approximately 248.8 billion Brazilian reals, are in a strong position to make such a purchase. However, the offer falls short of the £6 billion, 37.3 billion Brazilian reals, valuation set by the Glazer family, the club's current owners. Al Thani is the second individual to confirm their interest in purchasing the Red Devils, following billionaire Sir Jim Ratcliffe, the CEO of the chemical company INOS. According to Al Thani's statement, the offer intends to restore the club to its former glories on and off the pitch, with the fans placed at the center of the club once again. The offer will be entirely debt-free through the 9-2 Foundation, with Al Thani seeking to invest in the football team, training center, stadium, wider infrastructure, fan experience, and communities that the club supports. The vision for the offer is for Manchester United to be known for football excellence and to be considered the world's greatest football club. Further details of the bid will be released when appropriate, and if the bidding process develops. The commercial bankers Rain Group, acting on behalf of the Glazer family, set the deadline for new offers for Friday at 7 p.m. In other news, former Manchester United midfielder Paul Scholes praised Casemiro's excellent performance for the club in a recent Europa League match against Barcelona. Scholes, who is an idol of the club, likened Casemiro's style of play to that of another United player from the 1990s. Scholes highlighted the impact of Casemiro's absence from the team during a game against Arsenal and described him as a coach on the football pitch, noting his excellent forward passes and awareness of the players around him. Scholes went on to describe Casemiro as the closest thing he has seen to Roy Keane.